Let's say you had been elected president. Yes. How would you have gone about naming and appointing your minister? It would have been done in a week. That's maximum. We were even ready before the elections uh, with some kind of a shadow ministerial list. Okay. Of Nigerians. How do you even sift? How do you find the right people? Well, you know, I apart from being a you know a political activist, I've also done investigative journalism a lot. Okay. And I can do background checks on people. I, I do it for free. <laughs> so it won't be a problem to do it for my cabinet. I can background check on people. And then as president within a week, you should be able to check even within the security agencies who are who, you know, what's what's available with regards to these people's background. But okay. generally it's, it's, it's the easiest thing to do. And they would have been made up of very, very competent, you know, mostly young people. I'm okay. not gonna hide that. Uh, we were going to have a ministerial composition, uh, a system that's composed of 50% women and men, uh, so that that balance will be there. And, you know, it will have all the balancing that is needed, but mostly tilted towards competence.